All right, guys, let's talk about potency versus efficacy. All right, potency. So when people say, wow, I was potent, usually means like strong. So for step one, you need to know, it basically means how much activity am I getting from this drug in regards to its concentration. So what you need to know is, I'll zoom in here, is you need to know this graph that you will be asked to label it. So on the x-axis here, we got how much of the drug on the y, it's the response. So if you get a huge response for a small amount of drug, you'll be this graph on the left or this curve on the left. And that's what you need to choose. So most potent is A, least potent is D. Let's move back. Efficacy, efficacious. So this is ability to provoke a response or a physiological change. So the graph will look like this, the same idea. Response on the Y, concentration on the X. So if the response is really high that means it's really efficacious so the one with the highest response will be the most efficacious the one with the lowest will be the lowest efficacious all right this is guaranteed to be guaranteed to be on your exam so this is another free point all right potency versus efficacy hope you have a great day i'm one step closer to your dream score